we're going to go ahead and launch a new program today um, that we've been working on for a while. And, and this really did start back uh, when I was, I go to the gym a couple times a week. Doesn't look like it, I know, but I do. And uh, I, I started thinking about what we could do as an agency to kind of refocus some of our, our own efforts internally. And uh, I want to thank some of the folks that, before we even get started today, though, uh, Monica Ivey, Carlene Barron, Natalie Dale, they kind of took the lead and ran with this. And so they'll be soft rolling this out today. But you'll start to see flyers and some information going out. But what we're really going to do is challenge you on four different fronts. We're going to challenge you to be an innovative employee. We're going to challenge you to be a professional employee, to get professional training and opportunities. We're going to challenge you to be a healthy employee. And probably the most important thing is to be an involved employee, to give back something to your workforce and to your community and stuff. So a lot of different things that they're going to be rolling out on that. You'll see a whole website come out. So for those of you who participated in the Shape Up Challenge, you've already shown a desire for growth and change. As an agency, we are also embracing these ideas. Change has come to corporations, to our state, and to our agency. If we res resist it, we'll be very ineffective as an organization. If we simply just accept it, we would just merely survive as an organization. But if we lead the change, we will grow, and so will the, the citizens of our state, in the state of Georgia. We all must step out of our comfort zone and tackle these challenges to be innovative, forward -thinking way, in forward-thinking ways. We need to do this in the spirit of progress and growth. So I'm pleased to announce today our RG. Every Employee Counts initiative. This initiative will highlight the tools we have in place to support our growth in four main areas, innovation, professionalism, health and wellness, and community involvement. In order to be an organization that only, not only survives the test of time, but evolves, into the, uh, evolves in a way that allows us to have continued success, it is essential that we listen to each other, we share our ideas, and we enhance our communication skills. The traveling public will always be our number one priority, and it's at the top of our pyramid as we continue to tell our management team. We can best serve the, by committing ourselves to, to success as individuals and working toward continued success as an agency. Our goals may include taking more risk, but risks are easier to talk, take if we work together, communicate effectively, and share our ideas. I would rather us be known as a department that had a four and one record than a record that one and zero. And what I mean by that is we're a risk adverse organization. We don't like to take a lot of risk as a DOT. And, and uh, we've got to take more challenges and more chances with our limited resources. And so you know, we're empowering you to take chances and come up with ideas. I'd like to really start with you by visiting myg.ga.gov so you can navigate through these four, co four core function areas as we grow and best see how we can fit our personal and professional goals. Use these tools to write your own story. Together, these stories will shape the future of our GDOT. We owe this to the public that we serve to, to be innovative, professional, involved, and energized. Each and every employee makes a difference in the future of our GDOT. So working together, I believe we can do that. And, and, I, and I really mean that. I think we're, we're talking to the management team. We're talking to the district offices. And we're going to continue to drive that home that the best ideas continue to come from this group right here. And the, the managers and the employees all have to look, work together, listening to each other about how we can be a better organization. Uh, we, we talk about it a lot, but uh, sharing ideas will bring the innovative concepts that we need to do. And, uh, on this particular chart, this poster you'll see later this week, we're starting to roll out. Uh, we're leading the nation in innovation in a lot of areas. The utilitarians are a great example of that. They've done some amazing things in what we do in utilities across the country. We're a model. Just this week, we were announced for four of the what they call Sharp Two grants to take innovation forward. We were the only state that I'm aware of that received five of those Sharp Two grants to be innovative. Uh, 34 states were uh, participated. We were selected to do five. We're seen by other states as being innovative. Uh, I just came back from the Ashto annual meeting, and people asked us what we're doing. And Angela Whitworth, our treasurer, you know, she, she, I think it was eye-opening to her, she continues to see that people are following what we're doing in Georgia. I think you already have a lot to be proud of, but we can do a whole lot more. So uh, I hope you'll get behind this concept. I think if you look at it, it's structured, that it really is a RG dot, focus on us, every employee counts. And uh, I think you sharing your information, sharing your ideas, 
and telling the successes will make us a better DOT. So thanks for your time today.